Today, we're diving deep into a missile showdown between two cutting edge systems, Israel's Arrow 3 and China's DF-41. Which one dominates in range, speed and defense capabilities? Stay tuned to uncover a fact-based comparison backed by verified sources. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are analyzing two of the most advanced missile systems in the world, Israel's Arrow 3 and China's DF-41. Both are strategic weapons, but serve different roles in their respective military doctrines. Arrow 3 is Israel's high-altitude anti-ballistic missile designed to intercept incoming threats outside the Earth's atmosphere, effectively neutralizing long-range missiles before they re-enter the atmosphere. On the other hand, China's DF-41 is an intercontinental ballistic missile capable of delivering nuclear warheads over immense distances. While Arrow 3 is focused on defense, DF-41 is an offensive deterrent. In this video, we will compare their design, performance, guidance systems, range, speed, and strategic relevance. All the information presented here is based on credible defense sources, including Jane's Defense, Global Security, and verified military publications. We will look at what makes each system unique and where each excels or faces limitations. By the end of this comparison, you will have a clear understanding of how Israel and China approach missile technology differently. Let's dive in and break down the capabilities of these two formidable systems. The Aero Missile Program began in the 1980s as a joint effort between Israel and the United States, aiming to develop a high-altitude missile defense system capable of protecting against long-range ballistic threats. Over the decades, Aero evolved into the Aero 3 variant, which entered operational service around 2017. The DF-41, officially revealed in the 2010s, represents China's pursuit of a next-generation intercontinental ballistic missile with multiple independently targetable reentry vehicles, um, IRVs. Its development reflects China's focus on strengthening nuclear deterrence and strategic reach. The DF-41 is road mobile, allowing flexibility in deployment and survivability against preemptive strikes. Arrow 3, by contrast, is a stationary interceptor system integrated into Israel's multi-layered missile defense network alongside Iron Dome and David's Sling. Historically, both systems emerged from strategic needs, Israel's security environment, and missile threats from neighboring states versus China's broader geopolitical deterrence goals. Understanding the historical context helps explain the technological priorities and operational philosophies behind each system. RO-3 is a two-stage exo-atmospheric interceptor missile with a length of approximately 7.5 meters and a diameter of 0.6 meters. Its design emphasizes speed and maneuverability at high altitudes, allowing it to intercept incoming ballistic missiles outside the atmosphere. The missile uses a hit-to-kill mechanism, relying on kinetic energy to destroy targets rather than explosives. DF-41, by contrast, is a road mobile ICBM, roughly 21 meters in length and 2.25 meters in diameter. It can carry up to 10 min RVs, giving China the capability to target multiple locations simultaneously. DF-41's mobility enhances survivability, making it difficult to detect and preemptively neutralize. Arrow 3 relies on a combination of advanced sensors, radar guidance, and command link updates from Israel's early warning radar systems. DF-41 employs an inertial navigation system with satellite guidance, ensuring accuracy over long distances. While Arrow 3 is optimized for interception at high altitudes, DF-41 is built for maximum range, payload flexibility, and strategic deterrence. Arrow 3 is designed for extreme speed, reportedly exceeding Mach 9, which allows it to intercept ballistic missiles in ICSO atmospheric trajectories. Its range is roughly two 400 kilometers, sufficient for covering Israel and surrounding regions, and it can reach altitudes over 100 kilometers. The DF-41 is designed primarily for range rather than exo atmospheric interception with a reported maximum range of 12,000 to 15,000 kilometers. 
This allows China to reach targets across continents. The DF-41 has a speed estimated between Mach 20 and Mach 25 during re-entry. While Arrow 3's speed is tactical, aimed at intercepting threats quickly, DF-41 speed is strategic, ensuring that it can reach intercontinental targets while minimizing the window for interception. The contrast highlights the difference in mission profiles Arrow 3 is a defensive shield. DF-41 is a long-range offensive deterrent. Arrow 3 relies on advanced radar and satellite-assisted guidance. The missile receives real-time updates from Israel's Green Pine and Super Green Pine radars, allowing mid-course corrections. Its hit to kill approach requires precise targeting and split second adjustments during flight. DF-41 employs a combination of inertial navigation and Beidou satellite guidance, which ensures accuracy over intercontinental distances. The missile's MIRV payloads are independently guided, increasing the likelihood of successfully striking multiple targets simultaneously. Arrow 3's guidance system emphasizes rapid response and interception accuracy, whereas DF-41 focuses on long, range precision and strategic targeting. Both systems showcase state-of-the-art technology in missile guidance, but their applications differ fundamentally, reflecting defensive versus offensive priorities. Arrow 3 does not carry an explosive warhead. Instead, it relies on kinetic impact to destroy incoming ballistic missiles. This hit to kill approach minimizes collateral damage and maximizes efficiency against missile threats. DF-41, however, is designed for nuclear delivery. It can carry multiple nuclear warheads, my RVs, making it a potent strategic deterrent. Each warhead can independently target locations separated by hundreds of kilometers, enhancing its strike capability. Arrow 3's warhead design is purely defensive, while DF-41's is offensive and strategic, designed to secure China's nuclear deterrence posture. Understanding the warhead difference is critical to appreciating why these missiles cannot be directly compared in terms of destructive power. They serve entirely different roles in military strategy. Arrow 3 systems are deployed at fixed sites around Israel, integrated into layered defense networks. Their deployment requires sophisticated radar infrastructure and coordination with other missile defense layers like David's Sling. DF-41 is road, mobile, and can be launched from transporter, erector, launchers, TLs, allowing it to move between different locations to avoid preemptive strikes. Mobility gives DF-41 survivability and strategic unpredictability. Arrow 3's fixed deployment ensures highly coordinated defense coverage, but makes it location dependent. DFF-41's mobility is a key advantage for deterrence, as adversaries cannot easily neutralize it before launch. These deployment strategies reflect the core missions. Arrow 3 protects a specific region, while DF-41 extends China's strike reach globally. Arrow 3 has undergone multiple successful tests, intercepting simulated ballistic threats at high altitudes. Its operational deployment demonstrates Israel's ability to defend against medium to long-range ballistic missiles. DF-41 has also undergone tests confirming its range, speed, and MIRV capabilities. Although fewer details are publicly available due to secrecy, Reports suggest DF-41 is operationally deployed within China's strategic missile forces. Both systems demonstrate high reliability and technological maturity in their respective domains. Arrow 3's tests focus on defensive interception, while DF-41's tests emphasize long-range strike capabilities and nuclear deterrence reliability. Arrow 3 strengthens Israel's defensive shield against regional missile threats giving it a credible layer of protection against potential attacks. DF-41 enhances China's second strike capability, reinforcing its nuclear deterrence posture. The strategic implications are clear. Arrow 3 provides tactical defense for a small nation facing significant regional threats, whereas DF-41 allows a global power to project power and deter adversaries on a strategic scale 
Both systems are crucial to their national defense strategies, but they serve fundamentally different roles. Arrow 3 ensures survival, DF-41 ensures deterrence. In conclusion, Israel's Arrow 3 and China's DF-41 are two of the most advanced missile systems in the world, but they are designed for very different missions. Arrow 3 focuses on high-speed, high-altitude interception to defend Israel from missile threats, whereas DF-41 is an offensive intercontinental missile designed for strategic deterrence with MyRV capability. Comparing them highlights the difference between defensive and offensive priorities in modern military strategy. Both systems demonstrate the cutting edge technology and strategic thinking of their respective countries. If you found this comparison insightful, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel for more defense analyses, and hit the notification bell to stay updated with our latest content. Share your thoughts in the comments. Which missile do you think represents the future of strategic military technology?